We're gonna go check out a property that I'm buying, that I've got under contract. I have to pull permits on it. I'm gonna walk you through. I'm meeting with the structural engineer and everything like that. I'm gonna walk you through what I'm doing, what's going on with it. Um, we'll be meeting with Juan. Um, we're gonna be rebuilding this house. We'll just see everything that's going on. What's up, Juan? Hi, how are you, boss? Bien, bien, bien. Can I give you a microphone, por favor? You're famous. I make you famous. Why you make me famous? Because everybody like you. Mm -hmm. They say, this guy knows yes, how sir. to build a deck. All right, hey, let's walk through the house. We're probably gonna have our permits pretty soon on this one right now. So the guy who's meeting us is the structural engineer. His name is Samir. Let's figure out what we're gonna tell him we're gonna be building here. But what's your plan of attack here on this property? You demo, know that- Demo everything first. Demo everything. Demo what? everything and start working on the floor. Yeah, we're gonna have to rebuild the floor system. Basically, we're Take. also gonna rip this whole thing out. So did you already see the um, upstairs? Yeah, the problem is it's a one by sixes, you see? So it's one by sixes and we wanna vault it up. So what would we need to do with it? One by eight. So just rip the whole roof off or? No, 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 put it double, you know. Okay. Double the one by eight, brace it up. Okay, you wanna put a room upstairs, huh? I don't know if we wanna put a room upstairs. You don't wanna put a room and leave it alone. Only support a little bit more. Can we get a room up there? Let's go take a look. I didn't think about that. What do you think? Um, I don't know. How tall is this shit? Seven foot. Yeah, I don't think I wanna do that. I just wanna vault it. Yeah, yeah, you vault it. Do you wanna put a support to this head? Support, wire everything. You know why? Why you not put it the, the air conditioning here? Yeah, we could put it in here. We need to put it in here. And the water heated and everything. And I think- Well, I was gonna vault it, mm -hmm. so, but I don't think I'm gonna vault it now. Nah, I think uh, leave it alone, clean it, put a plywood on the top. Put a plywood here and uh, put it the water heated and put it the air conditioning, you know, the heat. And I think it's more We easy. need to put the, so here's one thing that we didn't do. On Maple, I feel like we should have put the water heater on the outside and put uh, tankless and make it gas. And Maple's gas. I know, we should have done it outside, gas. Tankless. It's better. Bec uh, more magnet. No, if we just put like. Yeah, you put it outside and to the wall and you hook this the stuff and everything. Yeah, the only problem is when you run the water lines, that one is the problem. Ah, yeah, you're right. But even if you do tankless upstairs, it's better. Yeah, it's more easy because it's only- This small. You yeah. know how to do tankless, right? Yeah. Which one's better, tankless or? Regular wood. Why? Uh, regular, because it's no, not a lot of maintenance. Uh, okay, so tell me what you can save here. Let's walk the whole house. Nothing. Oh, Nothing. <laughs> this floor need a fix. And this one too. Nothing is all the it's trash. Everything, all these yeah. ceilings, everything. I think that one you need to take it off. Yeah, we're gonna take that and off. Put a, a little patio, something. Yeah. I think this one is okay. This need to check in the bottom support. Well, we might as well do all new floors. Yeah, that's more easy. New yeah. floors and new. Make it everything. Look See, this is a gas. The old gas lines yeah. for the heat. Guess what I ran into the other day. Pocket door. No. Gravity furnace. Have you seen one of those before? Dude, I've never seen it. It's from like 19, tw 1912. It looked like an octopus. See, this one you need to take it out everything. Yeah. Clean it. See, choosing the top. <laughs> <laughs> no, these. <laughs> yeah. The windows, I think the windows. No, we got to put new windows. No, no windows. We got to put one window per one window and get rid of the rest. Nothing you saving in this one. Go ahead. Help yourself. We've already been in it like 20 times. So what we're planning here is, this is the goal. So we're just gonna gut this house, rebuild the floor system, probably whatever needs to be rebuilt. And then, um, what did you say was up to this one? Two by sixes. On the top, so we gotta change those. The ceiling joints are two by sixes. It's okay. You two by sixes should be fine, it's fine. So we're gonna relocate to the HVAC up there. And the okay, so that probably have to be a little bit higher, maybe eight. D doubles or two by eights. Yeah, double. just in the, just a certain location though, right? Where, where the heavy weight is, yeah. Okay, basically we're gonna turn this into a three two or a three one. Excuse me. We're gonna delete the windows and go down to one window per room, basically. So you have those plans. So this is the new plan. Yeah. So you're walking in. Bathrooms on the on the right side. To, b both bedrooms are on the left side, and then. Okay. So this uh, stairs, this attic access is gonna go away, right? Or you would stay. So listen, we're not gonna do it the way that Clayton might have said it. You know what I mean? I we're gonna just build the plan the way that it's designed on there. We're not moving that if he tells us to move it. Well, what he's saying is that instead of having the entrance over here, the entrance to the attic is gonna be from here. That's fine. I think uh, the joist going from end to end? Yeah, no, they... I think it's... Let's go upstairs and take a look. 
Be careful on that top step up there. See, these two by sixes are going the full span. Yeah, that's why I said the low bearing wall are the exterior walls, I think. We either have to put an upset beam over here to carry the load from there back to... Whatever is the cheapest, cheapest and easiest. Well, nothing is cheap. <laughs> <laughs> we have to be the, the most efficient and that, that's cost, schedule and, and the engineering. Right? right. So we have to be sure that uh, whatever we take out, load bearing walls out. Yeah, I think you're right. This is the load bearing, even though the joists are running full mm -hmm. span. So we might have to put an upset beam. So What's an upset beam? Yeah, let's go like this. Sometimes you put a brackets in the sides. Yeah, so upset beam good. is a beam up, up in the attic space. Uh -huh. It doesn't uh, hang down. Okay. okay, so you're saying up, just meaning it's up in the attic. Mm -hmm. Up in the attic, it'll be flush. I didn't know if you meant to attach it to the freaking roof line or what? No, 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 no. It, it'll be flush. The bottom of the beam will be flush with the ceiling. Okay. So it just won't hang down. So what kind of a beam are you talking? Probably a couple LVLs over here. Okay, LVL what size? Two. I have Eight. no idea. What's, what makes it an LVL? So it's a laminated veneer lumber. So it's a bunch of lumber, the uh, pieces glued together, glued together under high okay. heat and pressure. I okay. got one question. What is the difference? The regular wood and put a plywood in the middle. What is the difference in that one and the regular wood? Probably just rating, I would imagine. He's asking, what's the difference between an LVL and putting two pieces of two by ten and a piece of plywood in, in the middle? Glue when they glue it, they glue it under pressure and the control environment under a very high, heavy mm -hmm. hydraulics. It's like called sandwich. Yeah, the, I mean, the, the two, two by tens and the plywood will give you a little bit more strength than just only two two by tens, mm -hmm. but still the LVL is stronger. I will, I will check if two by tens or two by twelves will work here. We prefer that. Yeah, yeah, of course. No, I'm, I'm not going to go LVL just for, for the heck of it. Uh, <laughs> okay. I mean, luckily, there's no roof loads on it. It's only just attic loads. <laughs> hey, this one is two by eight. Two by eight and 16, huh? Mm -hmm. And I'm assuming there's a beam right here. Yeah, there has to be below the wall. Right here. Yeah, right here. There's a wall right here. There's a wall right there. This is my love. What you got? You oh, go. there you go. <laughs> Keep it, man. That's for you. So on this one, uh, what do you want from me on this one? Whatever the... I think, what, the City of Independence needed something from you. So the only thing is I think we're going to have to have an upset beam over here. Because this wall is coming out. And then the, the deck on the outside, this is new deck, right? Yep. We're ripping off the back side of the house. There's okay. not, there's nothing, it's... Right here, when you put it there, the beam right here. Mm -hmm. you need to go outside or need to go inside the wall? Inside the wall. Yeah, we okay. put, uh, so for the LVLs, uh, they're three and a half inches. If you use two of them, they're three and a half inches. Yeah, okay, so you have to put the two by fours uh, back to back. Mm -hmm. If they're two by twelves, then you can uh, do whatever. How much is an LVL? I think it's a... Uh, Eight hundred dollars, I think. Eight hundred? No. No? Can we okay. use... One deep, I think okay. it's a... Uh, um, Minaris has good price and uh, I, don't, I don't think they're that expensive. Let's ask Google. How much are LVLs? 199 bucks. Well, how much is a 2x10? The plywood and the 10 maybe $100. That's what we should, if we could do it that way without having to buy expensive lumber. Is there a better way to do it, you think? Well, you have a wall, you can't. Yeah. Yeah, you have to put a beam here. Yeah. So we'll design a deck for this. Piers. Yeah. With piers and then uh, lock, lock, lock. Low joist and all that stuff. Yeah, you don't need it. You don't need a tank rails in this one. No, probably, probably not. No, but there's, there's no tow enough. Yeah, to be over 18, there. I think there's 18 here, no? Yeah, so yeah think... we'll, we'll design deck for you over here. Yeah. Well, we don't. We could do it afterwards, to be honest yeah. with you. If you don't want to put it on there, I'd rather just focus on the structure. So if we want to take it out, we have to take it out from here. That's fine. Take it out with these, them, all these. Yeah. I don't want to cause oh. extra problems. I'll tell Clayton to take it off or or, or whoever. I'll, I'll have Clayton uh, send me you uh, got roof the CAD drawings because I don't have the CAD drawings. Yeah, I don't need them because we'll just build the deck. I don't want to engineer the deck. I mean, we built freaking, you know what I mean? Like we build decks all the time. We're going to put it. We're going to put the electric meter on the tree. <laughs> yeah, right here. <laughs> right there. That's it. It's going right here.